Good morning, Los Angeles. You know who the new USC football coach is going to be? No, I don't either. But I now have a great candidate for you. Hi, I'm Bill Plasky, Sports Columnist, Los Angeles Times, and this is your wake-up call. And his name is Kyle Whittingham. You want to see him, go to the Coliseum on Saturday. He's a coach of the unbeaten Utah Utes. A team that I think is right now the number one team, should be the number one team in the country, the best team in the country, We've had the best season of anybody. He has had nothing but success, sir. He's a defensive-minded coach. He's a student of Urban Meyer. Yeah, guess what? The last coach to be hired out of Utah was Urban Meyer. That worked out pretty well. He's led his team to an unbeaten season. They've beaten Alabama in a big bowl game before. He's done it, been there, done everything, except coach at the highest level and win at the highest level. And again, this is his, his chance this year to get Utah to the national championship. He'd be perfect for the Trojan job. I know you hear these talk, all these other names. Pete Carroll, forget it. Chip Kelly, no way. Kevin Sumlin, uh-uh. Sean Payton, eh, probably not. Nick Saban, yeah, ha-ha. A lot of names are being tossed out there. A lot of those names, USC either has no chance of getting or they wouldn't have any interest. Or in the case of Pete Carroll, I can't imagine the NCAA would really want him to come back to USC. Regardless, Kyle Whittingham seems to be, to me, the most solid candidate. And when asked about it this week, he said he didn't speculate on speculation. Which you know what that means. It means he didn't say no. It means he didn't rule it out of hand like everybody else has. Keep your eyes open and your ears tuned and we'll see what happens. But again, this weekend, the next USC football coach could be coaching on the other sideline. You can follow us at LATimes.com. Follow me at Twitter at Bill Plaschke. Have a great day.